Hey guys, Clawwolf here, and today we're going to be converting a 1.10 or 1.9 or whatever resource pack to a 1.11. Now, if you have a 1.8 resource pack that you need to convert to 1.8 or 9, 9 or 10, um, well, 1.9 and 10 are exactly the same, so you don't have to worry about that. Um, I have a previous video already before, and you can just refer to that. The link will be right here. You can click on it, or the link will be in the description for mobile users if you happen to be on the go. Um, so this is really, really simple compared to one, upgrading to 1.9 and 1.11. Uh, luckily, the way the Minecraft code works, and I'll be going over in a little bit, uh, it, it doesn't change much. I don't know why they did it, um, but they did. So what you got to do is you got to get your 1.9 resource pack 1.10. This is a resource pack that I converted from 1.7 to 1.9. Excuse me, and then 1.9 slash 10 to 1.11. Or I already converted it to make sure it works, but we're going to go over it again. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a copy, just so, you know, I have a copy. And then let's put this one up here. Okay, so we're going to go into the resource pack. Oh, let me rename it, it's just so we don't get confused. Let's call it Scary. Since in the name of Halloween, we're going to have a Scary resource pack here. Okay, so this one has a readme. This is just a guy's thing about things. Um, so what you want to do is you want to go into the pack MC meta and you want to go to pack format and change it to three And you guys ready for this you click yes Updates and That's it. You're done. That's it done 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 You're probably like what? What he changed he changed nothing But you see exactly this is the reason why it's really easy. So I'm just gonna say really quickly why it's easy so Minecraft only thing that changed in 1.11 so far, and if this is for the snapshot, so if I have a new one out right now, there will be a link to a new video that I've made if they change something like drastically. But I'm pretty sure this snapshot is pretty solid for 1.11, and I don't think they're gonna add too much more. So, what they changed in 1.11, they added new things, so of course, you would want to add new textures to your texture pack for those things but you don't need them in here you know uh you would want to add like say they added a new a new mob so you would want to add the mob but you don't your update when you're updating you don't care about that so anyway that what they changed was the entities and you see in the resource packs the entity naming system already has all lowercase they have their format where they do lowercase letters and if they have two words or at least something they think is two words um a compound word they'll do an underscore in between them which i mean from my perspective, the way that I code, that's really lame. But anyway, um, that's besides the point. So this is exactly, so the thing that they changed was so that commands, when you summon it or something, or you execute at something that is a wolf, instead of doing a capital W, it's a lowercase w. If you're summoning something that's a zombie pigman, instead of zombie pigman, and it used to be like zombie pigman with no space. Oop, it used to be zombie pigman with no space between with commands, but in textures, it was all re already like this. So I don't know if it just makes the game easier or more simple for them, but now it's all in the format that the textures are. So the name of the textures is the new name of the things in the game, which actually is nice, but it's going to be hard for command blockers to kind of get used to it. But you know, whatever. Anyway, so that's all you have to do. You just have to change from pack format to uh, two, to three, sorry, to three. Then what you want to do, as usual, is go to percent app data percent. If you're on a Mac, uh, PC. If you're on a Mac, you want to go to your uh, library, and then you want to go to your um, something. It's it's something like in your library. If you've done this before, it should be easy. And if you have a resource pack, you should be able to do this since you've probably done this before. Anyway, so then you move this into here. Boom. And you guys may be like, what? Harambe? What? Guns? What? Detective? What? Those are maps. Don't look at those. And you may be like, what? Ballistic version dot three. What is this? I, I really, I never record this screen, so you guys are probably like, what? Anyway, I'm just trying to pass the time, and here we go into Mojang 16W40A. So you can see this is the update that I'm working with, and I'm going to go on to, what? Call of Duty? What is Call of Duty? Nope. And then we are, <laughs> then we are going to turn off, ah, you guys can't see this, ah, I'm going to turn off this machine. And yeah, we're good. Okay, so that's that's nothing. That's just me testing things. Anyway, so now we're going to put on resource packs, and we're going to put on scary. And you're going to see and see how the others say it's not compatible. Well, this one is compatible, and it changed all the blocks. Everything's good. Everything's good. Everything's good. Everything's good. This is a 1.7 resource pack, so they don't have textures for these new command blocks. They don't have textures for stuff like Elytra and stuff like that. Um, and just as a quick little proof, I'll get the slime, the spider, the squid, 
Um, and I'll get the stray. And I'll get the ocelot. And I'll get the zombie. Yeah, okay. So you'll be able to see zombie, different. Sh stray, not different. Ocelot, this one's different. Squid, different. Spider, different. Slime, different. Actually, I love this slime. Look at that. Anyway, but yeah, that's how you update Resource Pack to 1.11. I just added some extra stuff in there so that you guys don't get too bored while I talk about random stuff. The sounds are the same. Everything's the same. Deal with it, guys. They didn't change much, and that's just how it is. Sometimes they like to make updates that, you know, really don't make sense. But, you know, we're not the coders of Minecraft, so we really don't know much. Anyways, guys, lesson to learn from this one. Most of the time, Resource Pack updates are dumb, and they don't mean anything. And look, a new update of Java. Another stupid thing that you don't really need to do ever. Anyways, guys, other than that, thanks for watching, and uh, I'll probably catch you all later.